Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another video of Hogwarts Legacy, baby. Banga, guys, without any further ado, let's get into the game. I think we are already in the end game. Abhidhan, nene kena. Alright guys, in the mission we will go. Oh, and then if bombard down there, Abdiya on the way la, we have to finish it. I mean, number part of quest party there, Glam. If we come across that kind of beast then we can do bombard out a spell dude what is the location here? I mean, I'm going to go to the bottom. Real quick, Stan. Good for you. Good for you. Expelliarmus. Accio. Incendio. Incendio. Oh my god. Finally. All right, nothing great. Whoa, we're not going to the I'm going to take a look at it, okay. Alright, let's wait. Right? 
Natty told me what the two of you did. High Wing's fine. I'm keeping an eye on her. She's safe, Poppy, I promise. Good. Whatever the poachers are up to, I want High Wing far from it. You said you had news about the poachers and that some of it had to do with me. It did. I overheard them talking in the Hogshead and... Did you know that they have orders from Victor Rookwood to capture you on sight? Does this have anything to do with Rookwood and Harlow coming for you in the Three Broomsticks after the troll attack? It does, somewhat. But at the moment, I'm more concerned about what else you heard the poachers are up to. Fair enough. But I hope you'll let me know if I can be of help, especially after what you did for Highwing. Does the name Horntail Hall mean anything to you? I'm afraid not. Why? What is it? The poachers best kept secret, apparently. The name came up twice, but they never went into detail. I also overheard one of them bragging about all the gold they're making, at the expense of innocent creatures, undoubtedly. The poachers spoke of this area, and I thought if we searched around a bit, it might give us clues as to what they're doing. If you ever meet my gran, this trip never happened. Not to worry, Poppy. If I ever meet your gran, I shall not speak a word of this. I normally tell her everything. She might be my best friend after Highwing, but she knows how I feel about the poachers. I think she worries I'll do something ill-advised. Whatever gave her that idea? This way. Tread carefully. An entire castle to roam, yet you choose to wander here. Please, we don't want any trouble. We're simply passing through. Do you take us for fools? That we do not notice more and more of your kind around here, in league with the poachers? We aren't involved with them. If anything, we want to see them stopped. I hope for your sake that is true. Our kind is swiftly losing patience with the poachers and those they work with. Why are you doing that? They are not the same. He was certainly a charmer. That could have gone worse. Centaurs aren't exactly fans of wizard kind, and the poachers aren't helping matters. But why would he think that we had anything to do with poachers? I did notice the poachers talking with a few villagers in Hogsmeade. I'm not sure why. Perhaps that's why the centaurs are suspicious. Whoa. That's the third time I've seen a dug bog behave that violently. It seems that a lot of beasts have been more aggressive than usual lately. I've noticed that too. It's almost like there's something in the water. This is odd. What is it? Not entirely sure. But look around. If the poachers were here, perhaps we can find out why. Why wouldn't they take their cages with them when they left? Revelio! Pelt. Poor beasts. Still smoking. They can't have been gone long. This is goblin metal. Seems out of place in a poacher camp. I should tell Poppy about it. Anything interesting? Poachers were here. All sorts of evidence. But I found something else. It's goblin made. I found goblin armor. 
Let's keep searching, but carefully. Merlin only knows what's going on here. I don't have a good feeling about this. What shall How we do, Poppy? Goblin and poacher interests align. Look, down there. Where? Definitely poachers. No creatures, though. So, what are they doing out here? Let's take a closer look. They won't be happy to see us. Should we use disillusionment? Or perhaps a less discreet approach? Hard to say from up here. Let's get a better lay of the land. himself what is going on here only one way to find out all right i think it's time for reparo incendio incendio now were in Hogsmeade so much, likely taking bets and spreading the word, given how crowded it is here. How could they possibly enjoy this? The centaurs have every right to be disgusted with wizard kind. There must be more dragons here. The poachers are far too greedy to run a fighting ring with only two dragons. We should take advantage of most eyes being in the fight and look around. But be discreet. You especially can't afford to be spotted. All right, all right. Na par launa porte aono me. Then I what Victor was sinking straight in the bar with them. Ah, I don't know what I'm talking Have you heard from your family? Has even of your brothers come round to our way of thinking? Will they join us? Ah, they say we go too far. The violence isn't going to get us what we want. <laughs> I say, if every last wizard is run through with a blade, then violence is going to get me precisely what I want. Sickens me to work alongside any of them. Don't know how Ramrock stomachs being near Rookwood. Foul beast. Not much longer now. <laughs> Mind you. 
Did you hear those goblins? Ramrock and the poachers must be working together. Poppy, something's going on behind you. What's going on down there? They must have only just captured her. She's putting up quite a fight. Not a fair one, though. Not with her chained up like that. Let's even her up, shall we? Let's go, Bobby. Look, they've got a dragon egg. Hepodean from the looks of it. We can't leave it here, not with the plans they likely have for it. Rebellion. Alohomora. All right, I have the egg. Ready. The element of surprise will only buy us a few seconds. Let's make them count. Careful! Oh, for the act. Damn. Not all all the levios, ah. Free her up. This may have been a bad idea. I suppose we'll find out.
Good work, John Wick. This way. In black. I'm guessing the egg we have belongs to that dragon. I don't think she knew they had her egg. She wouldn't have left without it. What now? She didn't exactly leave us a calling card. I, I don't know. Nothing about this day was expected. Not the goblins and definitely not the fighting ring. The last thing I planned on was a dragon egg. And the poachers saw us, which cannot be good. We aren't helping ourselves standing here. Let's get to safety. We can sort this out later. You're right. If there's anything the poachers are good at, it's tracking their prey. And right now, we're it. Be careful, won't you? I shall see you back at the castle. Yeah, good idea. the transformation spell after you've completed the required tasks which I'm certain will prove useful in finishing your field guide attend my class to learn the new spell afterwards we will discuss your progress Protego Stupefy Glacius Defender Accio Incendio Stupefy Glacius. Let me Glacius. Defender. Stupid one. Stupid one. This is easy to do. This is easy Oh, in get up on the wall. All right, here we go. Stupid. 
So this is the underground harbour. Revelio. The Grey Lady. I'd say hello, but she doesn't seem particularly social. Hello. I got front line there. Can we pass it all, Baba? This is after we confirm. I'm going to go there. No, anyway, I'm going to go there. Oh, this is outside Hogwarts. Hey, इंगे तो नहीं रखना first है। इंगे एक उपट पैर क्ला। Hey, Dick. That book Professor Weasley asked me to find should be around here somewhere. Looking for the book Intermediate Transfiguration. Oh yes. Professor Weasley asked me to uh. Uh, get something from that book. May I have it? Did she now? I'll give you this book if you humor me by answering a few questions from my quiz. Quiz? Some people call bits of knowledge trivia. I would argue that no knowledge is trivial. Hence, I have created a small quiz just for fun, focusing mainly on the law of the wizarding world. None of the other students will try it no matter how many times I ask. They all say they have enough with schoolwork. Ah, oh, they don't value knowledge the way I do. Surely you're interested. I'll even start you off with a few of my easiest questions. If that's the only way I can convince you to give me that book, then let's get it over with. Splendid! Just a few questions, and then I'll hand over this book. Let us begin. Before the invention of the Golden Snitch, which magical creature was used in a game of Quidditch? The Golden Snidget. Correct! The Snidget was first introduced to Quidditch in 1269 by a wizard named Barbarous Bragg. Sadly, they're thought to be extinct. Next question. Which potion is commonly referred to as liquid luck? Liquid luck, huh? I have no clue. A wild guess would be this. Felix Felicis. Well done! Since it makes the drinker temporarily lucky, Felix Felicis is a banned substance in all organized competitions. The tale of the three brothers involves which magical artifacts? Horcruxes. No, the answer was the Deathly Hallows. According to Beedle the Bard, the Deathly Hallows consists of the Elder Wand, the Resurrection Stone, and the Cloak of Invisibility. Which ball in Quidditch is the largest? The bludger. I'm sorry, but the correct answer was the quaffle. When a chaser throws the quaffle through one of three hoops in a Quidditch match, their team is awarded 10 points. True or false, Polyjuice Potion allows the drinker to change species. True. 
Actually, the answer oh my God. Of polyjuice potion can be used to change things such as age or race. It cannot be used to change species. Well, I suppose this has gone on long enough. I'll put the book back on the pedestal now. Oh, please. If you're inclined to test your knowledge again, I have plenty more questions I could ask you. And I won't be giving you any more easy questions either. The next ones will be more difficult. I I'm sorry. I don't have time for a quiz at the moment. Let me know if you change your mind. I put the book back on the pedestal for you. Revelia ought to make quick work of this. Professor Weasley's tasks are complete. I should attend Transfiguration. mother would like to speak with me. I believe she has learned about some of what we've been up to. I'm hoping she may be easier on me if you are there. Can we meet at the Three Broomsticks? It may finally be safe since we rescued the dragon from Horntail Hall. All right, before that, the Moody Porumbo. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor? Yes, the transformation spell. But first, I'd like you to carry out a couple of tasks which will help you to complete your field guide. Attend my transfiguration class once you've done them, and we can begin the lesson. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. But first, I'd like you to carry out a couple of... Attend my transfigure... Oh, I have not completed, is it? Settle down, settle down. Transfiguration, as you may be weary of hearing me say, is an exact science that can take a lifetime to master. But we needn't be daunted. Almost anything can be transformed if you can just perceive the potential within it. As I see in all of you, tremendous witches and wizards, every one of you, or it could just be my eyesight. Now, you all know what to do. Beautifully done. You wanted to discuss my progress so far this term, Professor. I did. You seem to have had no trouble in getting up to speed. And frankly, excelling in your schoolwork this year. Thank you, Professor. The extra assignments have been helpful. As I suspected they would be. Now it seems you've been making good use of the opportunities presented by your field guide. Of course, the guide isn't the only measure of success. 
I've heard that you can brew an impressive Edurus potion. Hopefully you won't need it anytime soon, but it is a valuable potion to have when it is needed. Thank you, Professor. I will say I'm especially impressed with all you've accomplished in light of the rumours of your extracurricular activities. Were your meetings with Professor Black's house elf and exploration of various caves down by the lake connected in any way to Professor Fig? Not at all. I was, uh, intrigued by stories of a giant squid and wanted to learn more. I encountered Scrope, who seemed delighted to share what he knew. I see. I admire your penchant for learning, but do remember that your classwork and field guide are designed to educate you thoroughly. It'll be the end of the year in no time, and you'll want to be well prepared for your OWLs. I'll provide a final assessment at that time to ensure that you're ready for your exams. Until then, well done. You are dismissed. Where are level scenes? Buying gra helpful are going to be great. Since our visit to Feldcroft, something dawned on me about the triptych. Meet me at the Overlook, just north of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll explain. Oh my God, Sebastian! If we're not going to get that lead, huh? failed but i have another idea i think we may be able to find what we need at a goblin mine south of hogwarts let me so bring someone who speaks gobbledygook i remember our meat mentioning something about gobbledygook What this does, striking an enemy cursed by Crucio releases a projectile that curses a nearby enemy. Wow, this is sick. இதை மட்டும் தான் இனோ பெண்டிக் பம்பார்டா இதுக்கு அசைன்மெண்ட்டும் அவ்வளோ கஷ்டமாக இருக்கு கஷ்டமானால் இப்போ தேடணும் நான் போய் எங்கே இருக்கு அந்த பீஸ்ட்டுன்னு Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Level two, or level three. All right. Does it get any? 
any more cosy than Hogsmeade. Over here. This is a change of pace from our last outing. Don't remind me. The thought of that tent still makes my blood boil. I've been thinking about those poor dragons in the fighting ring. The collars they were wearing, they appeared to be goblin silver. I think a collar is precisely what we found at that poacher camp. I've never known poachers to use anything like that before. The dragon that attacked my carriage was wearing a collar, and Professor Fig was genuinely baffled by its behavior. That attack always did strike me as a little strange, seemingly coming out of nowhere. Surely you aren't suggesting that the collars somehow control the poor creatures? Exactly. Merlin, I don't think the dragon we set free was wearing a collar, but we should check. And if we can find her, we can return her egg. Must we? It seems a lot of trouble to go to for a creature we've already rescued. We should see this through. Let me find out where she is. There was something else that I wanted to discuss with you. I didn't want to press it before. It seems I may have caused you more trouble with Victor Rookwood. Why is he after you? Rookwood is working with Ranrock, and Ranrock is after something I found at Gringotts. Fig had a portkey that led us there after the dragon attack. It's a bit of a long story, and Fig had asked that I not speak of it yet. Goodness. Well, that certainly helps to shed light on what we saw at the tent. Don't worry, I'll guard your secret as if it were my own. I shan't press for more details. In fact, I should probably be going. I'd like to track that dragon down as soon as I can. I'll let you know when I have news of her location. Okay, Bobby. Oh, I do hope Mary and I... Excuse me, sir. Are you all right? Just barely. But I don't want to trouble a student with my woes. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. I'm not so sure. Name's Crispin Dunn, by the way. I trade in the surrounding hamlets. Do the most business in Aronshire. A lovely little hamlet. Just stunning gardens. Just the other day, the Daily Prophet ran an article on its scenic hedgerows. Actually, before I go on, I should ask. Are you afraid of spiders? Spiders don't bother me at all. You'd be impressed by how many I've dispatched lately. Lucky you. The hamlet's overrun with the vile things, and they're acting abnormally aggressively. I'm concerned about my customers, of course, but it appears that most of the hamlet's residents fled to safety. It's my friend Mary I worry about. I haven't heard from her, and I fear she's trapped in her cottage. Understandable, but why don't you check on her yourself? I would. But I have a crippling fear of the eight-legged beasts, which I, unlike you, seem incapable of conquering. I don't know what to do. Can you think of anyone who can help Mary? I'll try my very best, Mr. Dunn. Please do. If you can think of anyone that may be brave enough to help, I'd appreciate it. Thank you. They'll find Aaron Shaw southeast of Hogsmeade, just below the train station. I just need to buy on Sunday, Clan Paula. Capture up in our quest land. All right, let's go and check on Mary. Before that, before that, let's go here. You're back. Nice to see you again. Yes, I am back. In the what is the things la sell under the corner, bro? Look Thanks at the amount of by. money I'm Hope having. See you again. Broom upgrades. Vandar, I'm use for our casa. This must be Aaron Shire. Oh, right, let's keep an eye out for spiders. Oh. Damn. 
Expelliarmus! Whoa! Predator! Stupid! Accio! Incendio! Descender! reading these things in her cellar. That means there are more underground. I'll need to destroy every last spider in that cellar if this is to end. Oh my god. Where's the source then? Okay, in get a that the relic from Slytherin's spellbook can help her, I must find it. I'm requesting your help. Meet me outside of Feldcroft, near the catacomb. A ladder. Not sure I want to know where this leads. I'd best be ready for whatever I may find down there. Exax. Find and destroy all of these before the situation gets even. That's one egg sack destroyed. I should get the rest. I can't let them harm her. Levioso! Descendio! Accio! Incendio! Glaciers! Defender! Hey, Nina Sound, yeah. Oh, I have just destroyed three eggs. Where are the rest of them? I have some 
promising news about the location of our Hebridean dragon friend and where to return her, you know what. Meet me in the town circle in Hobbit. Confringo! Confringo! Stupid! Accio! Descend! Descend! Stupid! Confringo! Glacier! Defender! Accio! Incendio! Can't finish. If I need to destroy any of the exiles. Confringo! This is definitely going to anger your parents. I suppose I know what happened to Mary Portman now. She was breeding the spiders. Spiders are breed, but I believe that. All right, seven more children, and ah, Confringo. I hate to think that they see me, but I don't see them. Creepy shit dark in this party. These eggs must be destroyed. That's the last of the spider sacks. Oh my god. I hope that's the last spider. Confringo. Glaciers. Defender. Alright, I think it's time to use potions. I guess that's it then and then. Incendio! Defender! 
There's a victory that came none too soon. Nice. Oh, young girl, go on, both. All right. Oh, these are the toads, man. Levioso. Settle yourself. I mean you no harm. Nice. Quest updated. Uh. Diri call. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. But yeah. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. No need to be different. I mean you no harm. done I have some news thank Merlin about my sweet friend Mary I'm so sorry mr. Dunn she was an innocent victim poor Mary fighting for the Hamlet to the bitter end no doubt a noble sacrifice she truly was a remarkable woman remarkable she didn't deserve this few do I am sorry about your friend You'll be relieved to know that I cleared out the spiders. It's safe to return now. You? You cleared out the spiders? I can't believe it, but I'm certainly relieved. 
I imagine the first order of business will be to help the amulet rebuild. I suppose I have nothing to fear from dead spiders. Even so, you'll want to prepare yourself. The place needs something of a uh, clean-up. Thank you again for all you've done. I shall keep you apprised of the Hamlet's rebuilding. Glad I could be of help, and I look forward to visiting your shop the next time I'm in Aronshire. To dearly departed Mary. Imperial. All right, guys, that that's it for this video. Hope you guys like it. Hit the like button if you guys do, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.